Hey everybody, it's Service AJ, and welcome back to my playthrough of Tales of Berseria. In the last episode, um, we were defending Titania and trying to get everybody to escape. They did escape, and um, yes. now we got to figure out something to do with ourselves, because they all kind of left us behind on our order. A nice, a perfect haul. We love that. Antique tarot cards. Nice, nice. Fortunately, we still didn't get everything there, so we're heading back. As any good episode, of course, we had to have our expedition ready. But now, let's continue to the other docks. docks to escape. Don't forget that. I know. Arthur's first maxim, right? Ah, fuck Arthur. And his maxims. All of them. Oh, I guess I do have... Uh, I could do this. Oh, we're going to want to get into some. Oh, longbow. Praetor. I don't know if we've seen these before yet or not, but here we are doing it. Nice. We'll go ahead and guard a little bit. There we go. Give me that consuming claw again, please. Oh, wrong buttons. I've been playing Tales of Arise again, which I still haven't finished that game. Shame on me, right? Um, I'm about like 50 or 45 hours into it, though. So, I mean, we're not, we're not like slacking slacking, but I, I could do better. For sure, I could do better. Nice. There you go. Damn, Fee. <laughs> He's so cute and wise. Like how I just walked past that guy. Fuck him. Dun dun. I'm worried about this whole hostage thing. You mean? Yeah, that too. But Velvet's acting really strange. And that's unusual how? Moggy Lou! Yelling at me won't change anything. Her thirst for blood knows no bounds. And she's got all the self-control of a wounded beast. With the way she's acting, I'm not sure she'll be able to escape. She's cut her way through all her problems before. She can do it again. I hope so. But everything has its limits. There's no blade that will not break. Nor is there such a heart. When the time comes... You'll need to make a decision. It's best you start figuring it out now. When the time comes. Huh. I wonder what they're referring to. And it's odd for Moggy Lou to, like, have wisdom at all. Maybe there is something more to our little friend Moggy Lou, who's just a traitor. Let's get in there. We have to escape with our lives. Yeah, yeah, Discord, you yeah. <laughs> ha! I love Velvet screaming that when she does that shit. It's so dope. Boom. Goodbye, little sneaky poo. Hell yeah. Getting some more things to just hold on to, I guess. shook off our pursuit of course we did this is the von eltia no it can't be this is terrible turn back now what there's no way we can do that i finally deciphered the last part of the book if what it says is true then you know me not is already Coast is clear. All right, let's make a break for the docks. <laughs> You're running. <sighs> it's Lord Artorius and. Now's the time to negotiate for safe passage. Step back, your highness. The girl before you wants nothing other than to kill me. You better believe it! <laughs> this is a trap. We're leaving. Let me go! I have to save her! That ain't gonna happen, kid. Don't forget, you're my ticket out of here, too. I'm not your tool! <laughs> 
try to stop me and I'll take you down. Even you, Aizen. Mattis isn't gonna stop me! Don't worry. I have another trick up my sleeve. <laughs> that sword. Is that or a calcum? Good job, little bro. Never seen that before. Damn right! The hardest sword there is! It may be made of or a calcum. Stand down, Shigeru. Don't be a spoil sport. I'm just starting to have fun. Get caught in the middle of this, and even you won't survive unscathed. The one to face Velvet will be a nominat. Sister, did you miss me? Luffy! Velvet's brother? So that's his game. That's right. I am Lafayette Crow. And more. I am also Empyrean Inominat, the Suppressor. No. That's... Inominat? If you're gonna do this, you gotta commit. He's our enemy. I know! This is just... just another illusion! I'll devour all of you! So, uh... Interesting, so Lafayette has taken the form, I mean, Inomina has taken the form of Lafayette. Doesn't seem like we're doing any damage, actually. This is not good. Exactly. This boy is Empyrean in Nominat the Suppressor. But how? We took away his strength! By kidnapping the Therians? Sorry to burst your bubble, but you were a wee bit late. It was never about the amount of malevolence the Therians devoured. What we needed to awaken him was eight different types. Greed, conceit, lust, cowardice, selfishness, obsession. Those six Inominat had already obtained by the time you managed to tear the Therians away. That leaves just the two that Velvet carries inside her. Once Inominat has them, he will fully awaken. And I don't even need an Earth Pulse for that. I can eat them right here. I tell you will! If you're that weak, stay out of my way. <laughs> An illusion. That hurts, Velvet. Shut up! Shut up! Are you going to kill me, sister? Go away! Go away! Go away! <laughs> 
of it. It was always so hard for me. I was so frail. All I did was cause you trouble. Is that why? Is that why you wanted me to go away? you did I'm sorry I'm sorry Luffy it hurt didn't it Fee kill him please but please it's Luffy said he's he's my brother <gasps> but velvet I never wanted you to avenge me. I mean, it's that sort of selfish emotion that creates malevolence, that creates the demons. What? That's why I'm going to help Arthur. We're going to make all the pain in the world go away. Including that hate, that ugly malevolence in you. Ugly? Malevolence? The awakened Inominat will suppress all negative emotions. He will remake humanity into beings free from sin. You take away all their sins, and people aren't people anymore! I think that's just what they intend. Like how they steal free will from the Malachim. It will be a peaceful world, free from pain. So your goal this whole time was to rob people of their free will? If even an exorcist like you can let your emotions tempt you to betrayal, clearly it is the only way. <laughs> I'll make this world a safe place free from demons. That has always been my dream. Don't worry. My wounds will heal. Once I have eaten you, sister. of what you've done that I need to make amends. You've hurt so many people, and all for nothing. You can't... Poppy! But they're within me now. I'll find them. A weapon can't just be hard, you know. It's got to be flexible, too. Or it'll snap. If you're addressing me, do you care to test that out? Nah. I think I'll wait on that. At least until you and Inominat finish up your armatization. Shepherd Artorius, what have you done? It's all according to my plan, Your Highness. Let us return to the capital. That's a big oof. This is like one of the parts of the game that it's like it's hard to talk over. It's hard to talk with it because there's so much happening. <sighs> what just happened? We were eaten by an earth pulse. 
this happened to you before, didn't it? It's different this time. It looks like our awakened friend Inominat is using the land as his vessel. In other words, this Earth Pulse is now part of his body. I was able to flee him only because I found a rift in the Earth Pulse as it formed. So, Velvet and the others? I guess I won my bet. Took long enough. Bravo! You do have a talent, if nothing else. Oh, Melchior. If you're here, this place must be more important than I suspected. Move aside. I must close this Earth Pulse Rift. Bienzu, protect the Rift! Do well, and I'll forgive that little betrayal of yours. But if you run, my curse will follow you for eternity! You got it! It looks like I just won my bet. If I let you seal this rift now, I'll never collect. Illusions won't work on me. You can't break a heart that's already broken. That day, I interrupted my art when your heart broke. I suppose I was taking pity upon my student. But this time, know that I won't hold back. I will grind your heart into dust! <laughs> to see you're okay. It looks like we got sucked into the Earth Pulse. Are you alright, Eleanor? What about everyone else? I'm fine. But... Kill. Kill. They killed so many. Murdered. Slaughtered. It was all for him. I killed for... him. But he said I was... ugly. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. All for nothing. I can't. I have to kill. Die. Die. <gasps> the whole time, she... You're awake. Come on, we're leaving. I have to kill them. But Inominat is your... It's just an illusion! A fake! A trick! Or... What if it was really him? Then that means he betrayed me, doesn't it? You think I can't kill a traitor like him? Why? Why wouldn't I? Just how many do you think I've killed? You! Who watched me do it! I'm... sorry... Velvet! Fluffy, time to wake up. I told you to stop calling me Luffy. I'm not a little kid anymore. <laughs> grumble, grumble, huh? You must be feeling good. No, this is different. Uh, a vision of the past? <laughs> See, I killed him. It was easy. I'm used to it by now. All right, we're getting out of here with your power. But now! We've got to find Aizen and the rest. I said now! Enough! Stop it! They're the ones who need to be stopped! Isn't that right? I'll kill them. I'll kill them all! You must calm down. Uh. 
fine. I'll calm down and look for an exit. That's what you want, right? Yeah, this part's hard because it's like uh, have to get out of here. Let's keep moving Velvet forward. lost the Thanks. one thing that she was holding on to this entire time, you know, and that's the one thing that was driving her, and that's the one thing that she was able to uh, to hold on to, and and it's gone now. It's gone. Are you all right, Lappy said? Yeah, I am. But I'm worried about Velvet. This may be more than he can bear. Not that I blame him. Laffy said, perhaps you should rest within me for a while. No. But if you don't, then... I know. But if I hide, it'll only hurt Velvet even more. I should at least be at her side. You really have become stronger. But I haven't. I hate it. But there's nothing I can do to help Velvet now. Of course there is. Having someone nearby can be all the help you need sometimes. Like when I lost my mother. Eleanor. So let's keep an eye on Velvet while we search for the others, all right? Just remember that I'm always with you, Laffy said. I know. Thank you. All right, good plan. So let's run up here. I challenge you. Wow, I didn't even see these guys, but here's a new enemy. They're undead, of course. We only have these three, so we want to be kind of careful. We don't want to be getting into too much trouble, but, you know, Velvet's extra motivated right now, so maybe she'll be okay no matter what. But we are, I mean, we're getting to the nitty-gritty of the game now. We're getting close. This fight is over. We're getting close to the inevitable end now. What is that? like a snake of some sort it's just a regular enemy though the way it was standing it looks like it would be something more important but it's not oh god this hell lady caught up to me i don't know how she did it but she did as you can see they're quite freaky looking we want to get pushing on them immediately thank you eleanor and lafisa for being bad bitches and around me all the time goodbye hell lady Oh, here's another one, apparently. Die, get... Get ripped. There we go, consuming claw. Nice, Laffy said. Learned Elixir Vitae. Shout out to my girl. It's a good-ass healing move. Always is, in all of the games. Alright, let's... Head this way. Perfect. Is there anything down this way? I don't think so. I don't think we're got to worry about cat's chest or anything right now at this time. <laughs> I don't think that's uh, high on our docket. Excuse me, ghost lady. Ooh, that was freaky. He tried to get me right there, too. Oh, there is a chest over there. We might as well get I doubt it'll be anything too crazy or important, but eh, it's worth checking out anyway, right? just another life bottle times three though that would have been cool if i really needed him but i don't so it's fine all right there you go velvet break boost him nice oh that was easy that really was hardly worth your time velvet that was we wrecked them Alright, let's head up this way. It looks like there's obviously some other things going on. Some armor or something. Hello, sir. Kurogane, is that you? Not quite. Kind of close, though. Similar for sure. Nice. At least we got them all in a pile here, right? So we can just keep popping off on them. Nice, perfect. Murdered him like that. Good level up for Velvet as well. 
just getting experience out on deck here. Maybe not grade, but experience. So th that counts for something, right? Apparently there's two other chests in this area, but I've not seen them. We gotta go up this way, through the armor, and around. Thank you. I mean, we got the one chest, but there's more? Question mark? More? There's one over that way. Can't use the little cert, the rift board right now, unfortunately. You guys know how much I would love to use that if I could. Oh, peach gel times five. We're good on peach gels too, but they're obviously trying to stack us up. They're like, eh, this shit's going to be hard. Get your booties ready. And I'm like, okay. All right, we will. Warp, nice. Just looking around for chests. That boy who called himself Inominot. Could he really be Velvet's younger brother? It could have been an illusion intended to torment her. Don't you agree, Eleanor? I do. Velvet's objective is avenging her brother, after all. We've all seen how strongly she feels about it. I find it hard to believe that the one so dear to her is still alive. I don't know what powers Inominot possesses, but I think that really was her little brother. Velvet was able to see past Melchior's illusions. But look at her now. I just don't want to believe that the real Lofi could do such a thing. Could it be possible that Inominot was reborn into her brother's body? I don't know. But if that was the case, I'm not sure Velvet would be in so much agony. Yes, I guess. Inominot actually being Velvet's brother. It makes a twisted sort of sense. But it's too awful. Hmm. Yeah, there's quite a few theories that could be, and it could actually just be Laffy said. Um, all we know is that Inomina's power is something that we have not faced before. It seems much more intense than the things that we're used to. Looking for chests around here. I'm expecting a chest to be right behind me one of these days, but apparently not. Ooh, another expedition. That was pretty quick. Moonstone. Nice. We still have one more special thing in there, so we gotta get it. Excuse me. We're not trying to fight you spirits. Nope. Or the snake people. We're trying to avoid these things, if possible. Oh, okay. Just kidding. There's a Garuda in here, too. Yes. Let's pop off now. Get him. Hell yeah. Break boost on the bird. We love that. Eat this one too. Kick that hell lady right in the face. That's exactly what she deserves. Boom. Nice. You did, Laffy. Don't even worry. We're out here gaining levels like nobody's business. God. Why do they make the hell ladies faster than you? That's so annoying. If they want to force me to get into certain battles, but it's fine. Nice. At least now I can get Theroni eyes and you're screwed. Murder, murder, murder. Nice. Where you at? Come here, boy. We're gonna kill you too. Boom. Perfect. I also thought it was interesting to see Laffy Set stand up to Aizen like that. I thought that was a cool moment. I don't know if you guys felt the same or not, but I really like uh, Fee's development as a Mala character. But the one thing that they never have really answered, we've never gotten a good explanation for, is why does Fee look so much like Laffy? Life bottles can't take them. I appreciate the thought, though. And then up here, what's this? It'll probably be something I can't take. Haha, <laughs> saw you coming, jerk. Ooh, grape gels. We'll take as many of those as you want to give us. That's okay. If we got to use them, we got to use them, you know? Yeah, I was like, I'm ready for that ghost to appear on me again. Hmm. Is there going to be a chest behind me on this one? 
No, for the love of God. Well, in the next episode, we're going to be looking through more of this area and exploring this Earth Pulse that we've apparently gotten eaten into. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Tales of Berseria. Make sure to smash that like button for me if you have not already to show your support for the series. Subscribe to the channel. That helps me out even more. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!